Brussels sprouts. A vegetable, a lot of people have a problem cooking. I'm going to show you a foolproof way to cook these vegetables. It's gonna be quick, it's gonna be simple, and it's gonna taste really good. So here we go. So right now I am just taking off the ends of the Brussels sprouts and cutting them in half. So remember, wash all your produce. We'll discard the butts and we will season up the rest of our Brussels sprouts. And keep all your leaves. Whatever little leaves fall off, you can discard those, but keep your big leaves. If your big leaves fall off like that one, throw it in there. They're so good when they're crispy, crunchy. So this is what I season my Brussels sprouts with. I start with extra virgin olive oil. Nice drizzle. So our seasonings can stick. I put minced garlic. Good teaspoon. Black pepper. Garlic powder. You can go a little heavy on the seasonings because there's quite a bit of Brussels sprouts in here. Sea salt. And I have this Weber veggie seasoning. I love it. Granted, it says grill, but it does really well on the Brussels sprouts. And you can use whatever seasonings you like to mix up your Brussels sprouts to season them. And so we're gonna mix them up. Make sure all the seasonings on all the Brussels sprouts. If you think you need a little bit more oil, then by all means, put some oil. A lot of people don't like Brussels sprouts, but I'm a believer. I've made people believers of Brussels sprouts with this. Put a little bit more salt, a little bit more olive oil, and then I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do. Mix it up, mix it up. And then I go to a baggie. Put all my Brussels sprouts in a baggie, and then I let them sit for at least an hour. You can let them sit overnight if you want, but at least an hour. So my Brussels sprouts have been in the fridge for at least an hour. Remember, you can overnight them. And so we're gonna take a flat pan baking sheet, whatever you wanna call it, and put a piece of parchment paper. If you do not have parchment paper, it is okay. You can also use aluminum foil. We're gonna dump all of these on here. Make sure they're flattened out. Look at that, they look good. And we're going to a 400 degree oven for 15 minutes. At about seven minutes during the cooking process, I'm going to check on my Brussels sprouts and turn them. I'm gonna toss them around. See, it's getting a little crisp. That's really good. That's what you want. It's okay if it ends up over there. And then you go back in for the rest of the time. Our timer has gone off. Ooh, delicious. Those look heavenly. Look at those toasted parts. They look really, really good. 
And these are literally ready to serve for dinner. I'm going to taste one. See if my salt is okay. That's really good. You need a little bit more salt, by all means put some more salt, but these came out really good. So I don't need anything else. So enjoy your Brussels sprouts. And don't forget to like, comment, share, and, and subscribe. Go ahead. Do it again. I got it. <laughs>